Hey, what's going on? You know who it is. You know what it is. This your boy Town Biz. All right, man. Check this out. All right, man. I just got to say this. I may be, you know, jumping the gun a little bit or getting way ahead of myself, but you know, things happen. I mean, it it could happen at any moment. Who would thought that Will Smith would have <laughs> walked on the stage and, and, and smacked the taste out of Chris Rock's mouth? So you never know when a per person reached a boiling point, any and everything could happen. And you just got to wonder, will that happen to Russell Wilson? And I'm going to further talk about this whole thing about nice guys finish last and the whole Pookie and Ray Ray situation and, you know, dating Keisha and Riri because that's exactly what Rihanna is. She's a Riri. She ain't nothing but a female version of a Pookie and a Ray Ray. That's all Sierra is. And she's proved it time and time again. At the end of the day, you know, she don't seem to appreciate what she have. And the funny thing is, Russell Wilson tried to help her get her masters to her music. Now, I checked and did some research. They're saying that she doesn't own her masters, saying that he did not acquire her master. But people are saying that he did. But nevertheless if he did do it or at least the fact that he tried to do it that just goes to show you what a good dude he is and like i said before um it's just a shame that sierra just disrespects her husband the way she does walking around with that outfit on like she don't got a care in the world like she isn't a married woman but you know at the end of the day you know um so like I said, when eventually she get tired of Russell Wilson or Russell Wilson get tired of her or they mutually agree to split and Russell Wilson ends up with a woman that isn't black. Like I said, I don't want to hear nobody saying nothing. I don't want to hear none of that stuff. I don't want to hear none of see black dude. I don't want to hear none of that stuff. And that's just real talk. Um, but nevertheless, I am worried about Russell Wilson eventually having a, you know, Will Smith moment. Because he might be one of them type of dudes that's holding it in and he trying to keep his composure because you never know, know when it's going to happen. You know, Will Smith is a Libra. You know, he a Libra like me. And I can tell you right now, when we go, we go. And Will Smith held all that stuff in from him basically trying to compete with, you know, a man that's been gone for over 25 years and Tupac Shakur to just a whole bunch of other uh, stuff going on and how his wife, you know, basically emasculates him on a regular basis. And I got to say this about Jada Pika. Jada Pika got little woman complex. And that's, that's just real talk. Um, She, she do. And as far as Sierra go, like I said, um, she for the streets and she wants to be for the streets, you know, because she and to think that she went to church that day and then she, I mean, but yeah, I'm just worried about Russell Wilson having a Will Smith moment because, like I said, you never know who thought Will Smith would walk on the stage at the Oscars and you know, and basically smack the taste out of Chris Rock's mouth. And it's kind of funny, more and more people, as they really start to look at Chris Rock and see what kind of dude he is. Like I said before, Chris Rock is trash. He he trash and he a hypocrite. Like I said before, he can sit up there and forgive two white boys for calling him the N-word with the ER right to his face. And he didn't do nothing, didn't say nothing, didn't check him. But he can sit up there. Like I said, he just like the rest of these dudes, got all the sm smoke in the world for black people. But he can't forget Will Smith. So, you know, and I'm gonna keep rat and I'm gonna keep ragging on dude. And that's just real and that's just real talk. But I am worried about Russell Wilson. Uh that could explain his poor play last year. Because that Russell Wilson that I saw last year wasn't the Russell Wilson that I saw in previous years. You know, Russell Wilson uh was a MVP candidate many, you, you know, a lot of times he's always been a solid quarterback and many people believe Russell Wilson is headed for the hall of fame. 
I don't think one bad season should resonate him being taken out of the Hall of Fame discussion because he has a Super Bowl. He has a Super Bowl win. And I think Sean Payton's going to come in there and turn turn his, you know, uh, turn his career around. Get him back to how he was during the Seattle years. But, yeah, I am worried about that happening with Russell Wilson. I hope it doesn't. But let's just keep our fingers crossed. You know, at the end of the day, sometimes you got to cut the dead, the, the dead weight off or you got to trim the fat off the meat. And maybe Sierra is just giving him too many cal- too many bad calories because she blatantly doesn't respect him. She's sitting up making songs about being an independent woman and all this kind of stuff. And then she dressing like she don't have a, a husband and, and children. So that's. Speaks volumes. But anyway, let me know what you think. This is your boy Town Biz. I'm out.